Yeah. Mike Sullivan, I'm a former IRS agent and teaching instructor with the IRS. You may be asking, what's wrong with my face? I had to use some FUDEX. It's to get out all the very light uh, skin cancers that have I've accumulated living in South Florida. This is a burn, so it's all going to come off. So I'm really not a freak. Anyway, I am a former IRS agent, a teaching instructor with Internal Revenue Service. Uh, welcome to my YouTube station. Just call me Red Face today. You're welcome to do that. You won't offend me by Red Face either. Uh, anyway, today I'm going to talk to you about, you know, people just uh, will will e write, email me and ask me these random questions like, what's it lo like to work at Internal Revenue Service? Well, I will just tell you out of college, I went ahead and got a job. Uh, they hired me right away. I was actually, I just turned 21 and uh, I got a job <coughs> as a revenue officer. Uh, working at IRS is like working at any other corporate job. It just happens to be a three-letter word. IRS, DEA, FBI. It's a corporate environment. It's that, it's that simple. Um, you want to hope that when you work there, your passion and your giftedness matches the job you have. So they wanted to hire me initially as an auditor. Well, I would have been a bad auditor because I really don't like books and records. I just don't like to make all these journal entries and do all that. I'm just not that type of a person. So I think that if you're going to work at IRS and you're asking what it's like, I think that every division has its own neat things about it and difficult things about it. Um, I think the coolest job for at IRS is being a criminal investigator. Uh, you get to go out and, and investigate financial crimes. You can get premium pay doing that. Sometimes you travel all over. It's a really neat job. You can do surveillance on cases, but you find your own business as a special agent. What do I mean by that? I mean that you've got to look in the newspapers and comb through everything and try to find cases. About half of your inventory is given to you, but you've got to find and develop the other cases. So if a, a CID agent is reading an article online and there seems to be some fraud going on, they may just start investigating that case and, and bring it to, um, bring it to uh, the Department of Justice for uh, prosecution. That's what they do. Now, auditors, you know, you got to really love books and records if you want to audit people. And there's a couple different types of auditors. Those are those are really anal about their job and those who aren't really anal at all. God, I don't even know what side I want to look at. This is terrible. I feel so bad doing these YouTubes with my face, but I love to do YouTubes and give you information. Anyway, the auditor job is God. You got to just love to do tax returns and do examinations, and that wasn't me. So if you love to, you know, look into a tax return and and find out if someone has all the records or not, and 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 would be willing to negotiate, an auditor job is for you. For me, I love being a revenue officer. I love being having a debt, trying to pick up tax returns, do a little financial analyzation on how people can can uh, can can pay IRS back, file liens, levies, and garnishments. Actually, when I was there, I would seize houses, boats, cars. I worked uh, in, uh, in the, uh, drug enforcement cases. Anyway, it's a good job. It's a good paying job. You get paid every two weeks. You get that green check, or they just deposit in your uh, in in your bank account now. So anyway, at the end of the day, if you're thinking of a career for the Internal Revenue Service, it isn't bad. It's uh, and you got all the corporate that, that everyone talks behind everyone's back. It's the same old crap. Whether you have a badge or whether you have a commission or whether you work here or there, working for IRS is just working for a three-letter uh, a three-letter company. But at the end of the day, it is a good, it's a secure job, and um, you get to bond with the people that you know. Um, if you're, like I said, thinking of going in that, there's there's nothing wrong. I really enjoyed my time at at Internal Revenue Service. You know, I just want to share one other thing. When you go there, you're kind of really impressed you worked at IRS. And then you kind of transition halfway through and say, okay, it's kind of cool, but I have a job to do. And then really toward the end of your career, how long you're going to work there, you become more moderate. You start giving people a break. I, I, I hate when I get new agents on cases 
because I know how they're going to be. They have to please their supervisor and want to show they're doing a good job. So if you're hearing this from and you got a tax case, if you got a new agent, you're probably going to be in for it. But if you're looking this to, uh, like I said, get a job, your whole your attitude will change the longer you're there. You can feel free to ask me questions. I did work there 10 years. I was also a teaching instructor where I teach people what to do. Thank you.